Around the world there are hundreds of strange and surreal phenomena, objects, and incidents that never fail to perplex science for their absurdities. Have you ever heard of a chicken army, or underwater mailbox, or a forest made from stone for that matter? Some of these videos are astonished with the knowledge of such incredible things that happen in the world. Research has shown how our environment plays host to many incredible phenomena that you may have only heard but not seen. And today we'll take a look at top 15 things that you will see for the first time in your life. Before we begin make sure you hit that subscribe button to get notification every day for more amazing content. Chinese Farmer Chicken Army a Chinese farmer named Sang Kingjin walked his 70,000 chickens and also trained them to fly in northern China. In the clip, Sang Kingjin is both a chicken farmer and a rising internet star in China. Sang returned to his hometown in the Heilongjiang to raise some chickens on a large plot of land where they could run around. When taking his chickens out for exercise, Sang takes along his mobile phone so that he can capture video and shoot liver streams about his daily life. He joins an ever-growing number of unusual internet stars from China's countryside. Sang said he needed to walk the chickens for around 10 km daily and also to train them to fly so they will be fit and their meat will taste better. An adult pen skating on thin ice. Thousands of lakes across the northern hemisphere are set to lose their winter ice as global temperatures rise. Their new study suggests that, within a generation, over 35,000 lakes will lose their winter cover. The researchers involved say the disappearance will have significant implications for millions of people living near these bodies of water. It could also pose a threat to supplies of drinking water and a fish species. This small lake outside Stockholm, Sweden, emits otherworldly sounds as Martin Agen skates over its precariously thin, black ice. Wild ice skating, or Nordic skating, is both an art and a science. A skater seeks out the thinnest, most pristine black ice possible both for its smoothness and for its high-pitched laser-like sounds. Chimpanzee without hair. The pumped up chimpanzees, who all suffer from the hair loss condition alopecia, showed just how ripped the burly beasts actually are. It's no wonder biologists say the aggressive jungle creatures are at least four times stronger than their human cousins. However, when it comes to muscular strength there really is no comparison between the two. Despite being hairless, inherited from his equally smooth father Jambo, Mongo was a hit in his group. Early in life he had to work hard to be accepted, but was recently an integral part of the strict hierarchy, headed by his father. He was also popular with the ladies, particularly Noddy, who was usually close by. Chef Fastest Mix Food In China, it is very popular to mix huge amounts of food on hand. In this clip, a Chinese chef mixing food very fastest with his hands. A human-sized bat in Philippines. They are described as backquote human size and are fond of tightly wrapping their giant black wings around themselves and hanging from rafters, giving them a decidedly vampire-like appearance. Although these creepy creatures are not an unusual sight in their native Philippines, the giant golden crowned flying fox is one of the largest bat species in the world. While fans of the creature are fond of emphasizing its 1.7 meter wingspan, the bat's body is only about 30 centimeters long. It also said that these bats are vegetarian and consume fruits. People from the Philippines also confirmed that they have such giant bats there. The enormous bat is an endangered species as a result of deforestation and hunting. <laughs> Swarms of locusts. Plagues of locusts are swarming large areas of southern Russia, threatening thousands of acres of crops, and in some places darkening the skies. A clip shot by a local man in a Chikilak, a village in the Stavropol region, shows thousands of the bugs swarming towards the church. Other videos screened by local channels showed clouds of locusts flying overhead. 
locusts had migrated from neighboring Russian regions, meaning authorities were unable to halt them easily, threatening what is one of Russia's major farming areas. Swarms have been reported across many other southern regions, stretching from Chechnya to the Astrakhan province on the Caspian Sea. Because of the locusts, a state of emergency has been declared in three regions near Stavropol. All around the world authorities currently had the infestation under control and were spraying pesticide every day. Unique Hand Fishing during a severe drought, rivers and streams tend to dry up, but fish and other freshwater organisms need to survive if they are going to be around to repopulate the stream in the next wet period. The African sharp-toothed catfish is a large eel-like fish, usually of dark gray or black coloration on the back, fading to a white belly. In this video two boys fishing in a hot dry mud and surprisingly they were catching many catfishes in secret dry mud hole. These catfish have a unique ability to endure extremely harsh conditions, able to tolerate very low oxygen concentrations, and can even survive for considerable periods out of water. Tornado hit in Canada. A swirling tornado has been filmed hitting land less than two miles away from a farm in a prairie province of Canada. Farmer Jerry Bourgeois stood behind towering metal silos in Woodrow, Saskatchewan, as he filmed the angry mass of clouds forming to the south of his land. The tornado was filmed on Saturday afternoon as it spiraled across the flat landscape. Farm equipment could be seen in shot, suggesting Mr. Bourgeois was working when the phenomena struck. Suddenly, the tornado which had been gathering in the air hit the ground. The clip showed how dramatic weather can get in the Canadian province, which is known for miles of grasslands on its southern plains. South African Duck Parade the quacking is soft at first amid the vineyards that roll for miles in this South African winemaking town. But then the duck handlers whistle and wave their white flags, and the noise reaches a crescendo. All 1071 ducks huddle at the gate that separates them from the vineyards. It's time to go to work, and the daily duck parade is about to start. This wine farm is winning praise from environmentalists for using Indian runner ducks instead of chemicals to eradicate pests like snails and bugs from its vineyards. The duck parade is also a colorful affair that attracts tourists. Duck handler Denzel Mathis has worked with the ducks for the past three years and says he has grown to love the creatures. <laughs> Monarch Butterfly Migration Each fall, millions of monarch butterflies leave their summer breeding grounds in the northeastern US and Canada and travel upwards of 3,000 miles to reach over wintering grounds in southwestern Mexico. But unlike birds or wildebeest that also embark on epic migrations, these individual butterflies will never return. As the days get shorter and the temperatures drop off, monarchs begin to abandon breeding and feeding territories in search of a safe place to spend the winter. For monarchs, that overwintering ground is found high up on just a few mountains in central Mexico. Once there, the monarchs huddle together by the millions on the branches of oil fir trees. These monarch larvae consume vast amounts of milkweed before forming a chrysalis and transforming into adult butterflies. It might take the monarchs as many as four to five generations to complete the journey all the way back up to Canada. Wakeboarding a Cranberry Bog In this clip, Josh Tranby and the crew travel to the town of Tom in Wisconsin to create a visually stunning wakeboarding session in a cranberry bog. Before harvest in autumn, the irrigated fields, where the cranberries are grown, are flooded with between 6 inches to 1 foot of water, before a harvester is driven through the water to remove the cranberries from their vines. The berries then float to the surface of the water, creating beautifully crimson carpets. The floating berries are then either pumped or conveyed to packing stations, where they are sorted, cleaned, and stored. Underwater Mailbox Japan 
when the Japanese town of Sasami in the Nishimuro district of the Wayakama prefecture decided that they wanted to have more tourism, Toshihiko Matsumoto, the postmaster came up with the unique idea of putting a mailbox underwater. This mailbox currently in use, but it does require the purchase of waterproof cards and oil-based pens. Once the postcard is written all the sender has to do is dive down and insert it into the mailbox at the ocean floor for later pickup. Masumoto's idea was the perfect tourist attraction that this beachside town needed. Escape Quicksand in France This French island has a shore of quicksand. Learn to escape quicksand. It's off the coast of this French island. Test your skills on the banks of Mont Saint Michel in Normandy, France. The island has some of the most extreme tides in the world. Mont Saint Michel is a medieval island commune, complete with an abbey at the top. It's right off the coast of Normandy. The tides can vary by 46 feet. At low tide, the ocean recedes, and visitors can trek across the wet sand to the island. It's best done with a guide who understands the tides and can teach you how to escape the quicksand. Thanks for watching. Be sure to give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to always be in the top 10 videos world.